If you've been watching my channel recently, you may have seen a demo of the Ami FX Rothcast, and that's a wonderful, brilliant pedal. And it made it straight to my board, and now I have the Ami FX Umami here. And much like the elusive Japanese taste, is it savory, is it salty or sweet? I don't know. I probably know what it tastes like, but I haven't pinpointed yet. Like, that's umami. Well, this sounds like umami. It's a little bit of everything and it's really, really versatile. The controls work much like you would see on an amp. They're all interactive, so if you increase treble, it might tighten the bass response. There's a volume right here, there's a master volume. You get bass and treble, treble, bass. And there is an attenuator switch because this pedal has so much volume. I was playing just now and it started clipping the interface. That's how loud it is. If you raise the volume and the master volume, you get a lot more gain, of course, and if that's what you're after, the difference between the clean tone and the volume from the pedal might be way too big. Um, so that's why they added that attenuator switch so you can like flick it up and then it's minus 10 dB uh, and it'll be much more balanced with your other pedals and the clean tone coming from your amp. So we'll get to that in a bit. Um, intro was played on the wonderful Panucci Telly. Now I have my Giordano Horny here going into the Silktone amp. Through the bus was a tube amp expander into the interface. And let's start with the clean tone because I heard that a lot of people like it when you play the clean tone first. Travel. Less travel. This will get quite fuzzy when you turn up the game. Um, I'll do that in a bit. Alright, so more bass. Alright, cranking the master volume. So now I'm pushing the amp. If I crank the volume, I'm pushing things inside the pedal. So it works also much more like the Roughcast because it has a like a boost master volume and a pre volume as well. Really, really good. Um, so more volume, let's crank the master as well and then... It's incredible that a pedal can go from like a super sparkly clean boost to... Uh, 
So now I have the attenuator switch up to minus 10 dB because and this is minus 20 might work for some but too extreme for me I really really like this It's almost tone bender like. Let's try it with our harmonic tremolo. Me effects, as far as I'm concerned, it's the discovery of the year. Man, that guy knows how to build pedals. Um, a me effects umami. So let me know what you think down below in the comments. Uh, if you have any questions, ask them. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to my channel because it would help me a lot. And if you want to score some of my gem tracks and tabs for licks you can steal, uh, you can find us on my Patreon page or become a YouTube member by clicking join down below. Thanks. Bye.